Hi Taurus, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love bite. Taurus, let's see what message wants to show through for you today. And of course, these are general collective readings. Taurus will not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind. Take what works for you and leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers. Thank you. Thank you for being here. And Taurus, if you're new here, we welcome you as well. Do join us, subscribe to the channel, become part of us. We welcome you in. All right. We have a Queen of Swords in reverse, center of my spread today. Uh, Taurus, somebody's really upset, angry. They don't trust very easily right now. Mm, well, somebody wants to start a new, they want a brand new beginning. They I have a king of wands here who wants to take action. They want to come forward, take action, but there's a little bit of confusion because they, maybe there's no communication between the two of you. Maybe this queen of swords has not putting in work or investment. There's a bit of disappointment. Um, this could be a commitment. Because I have the hierophant, I have the seven of swords the devil and then the death card so well the death card doesn't always have to be bad right it doesn't have to be an ending because soon after i have after that i have this the fool card this is like a let's start afresh let's put an end to the old and let's begin again so let's see what's going to happen i'm going to start uh, taurus with some dialogue message cards let's see if you guys could say something to each other what that would be and then of course we'll clarify all these cards for you so, <clears throat> Taurus and their person spirit, Taurus and their person, thank you, I'll take a few more, Taurus from another deck and if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is in the description box below, you can reach me there, Taurus and the person, okay, and a few more from here, Taurus, Taurus and their person, The first card here, Taurus, is you say that I'm your divine true love and that I'm always on your mind. I don't understand. Then how could you have then ghosted, ignored or even blocked me so much over the years? There are times when you've denied my existence so much that I felt that the pain might only end if I no longer existed. I eventually had to let go in the physical world because the pain became too much for me to bear. My emotional, mental and physical well-being became affected negatively. I'm still fighting my own inner demons where I felt that I wasn't good enough for you and the guilt of wondering if I walked away too soon. It hurts me that you continue to choose others over me. What do they have that I don't? Or don't you feel worthy of a real connection? My mind is in turmoil trying to fix, trying, trying to figure out how I can fix the mess that I've made. I've been suffering from sleepless nights and feeling very low and anxious. This could be this king of wands who's now wanting to take action and fix, you know, the upset that they've caused this Queen of Swords. I think of you before I sleep, I dream of you all night and I wake up to think of you again. I'm involved with someone else and it wouldn't be fair to either of you to pursue our connection at this time. We see this from two different perspectives. Do you think about me? I'm healing my heart from past hurt. Give me some time. All right, Taurus, these were some of your messages. If these were resonating, let's start your reading. Of course, with an angel blessing card. Let's see what my angels have for you today first. Okay, a blessing, guidance, advice or a message. Move. So there is some movement coming into your life, uh, Taurus, whether you like it or not. There is somebody, I think, who wants to take action now. They want to, well, change things around. 
this is the message from the angels that uh, it's time for some movement and also uh, Taurus if 1% you are this queen of uh, swords who's in reverse well don't let this anger and bitterness get the best of you do some physical uh, you know action could be dancing could be exercise could be yoga swimming something to release whatever anger that you're sitting in because that's not going to do you very good okay so what move, movement is going to maybe release this very tight energy that is there and if you're the king of wands who's the taurus here uh, watching well it's time to make that move uh, taurus it's time to make shake things up a little bit okay let's start now uh, king of wands since you're sitting up right here in the upright looking really handsome ready to take action i'm going to give you the mic Let's see what this King of uh, Wands wants to say to us today. King of Wands has the mic, uh, Taurus. King of Wands, what do you want to say today? Mike is with you. Oh, they're very stressed out. They are, they are, there, there was a card here. I'm suffering from sleepless nights and uh, feeling very low and anxious, trying to um, the mind is in turmoil trying to figure out how I can fix the mess I've made. Uh, well, they do want their home or their security or their uh, person back and they want this to come back together. They're trying to figure out how they can make it work again. So, uh, Seven of Cups. Seven of Cups. One more. They are trying to figure out what to say, how to say it. There's a bit of confusion there because uh, they are trying to figure out the right way or the right things to say. Maybe there's been some injustice, Im imbalance in the past here, Taurus. Uh, this person is trying to figure out the right words to say that either you take them back or um, they can come back or something like that right they desperately want their four of wands they want to come back but the confusion is how do i fix this injustice that i've done uh, they do want to come and clear the air they do want to talk because i think at the present time there's there is no communication or maybe very little uh, eight of wands eight of wands yes this uh, somebody does want to take action they want to they they are coming that's all I can say. Somebody is going to be taking very swift action right now. They ha they have a lot of love in their heart from what I feel. They have been waiting, spying, uh, maybe for the right time to come forward with this communication, to make that change. There has been a lot of waiting, watching, spying as to when I can maybe move forward. Uh, seven of Pentacles in reverse spirit. Seven of Pentacles. Maybe this Queen of Yeah, this Empress is the one I think who could be very disappointed because they feel their person doesn't put in the effort or it's been like a waste of time, waste of energy, waste of whatever. This Empress could be blocking them right now. This Empress is in reverse, Queen of Swords is in reverse and uh, the little bit of you know, pushing out or blocking or not wanting to make a decision right now. But I do feel the other person still sees that this Empress as their happiness and their future, their stability, their happiness, their Ten of Pentacles. So Queen of uh, Swords, why are you in reverse with all these glorious cards around you? The Queen of Swords says, well, I haven't been happy. I, none of my wishes came true, right? I have been living in a space where I've been feeling depleted. I, I haven't been happy. This is a card of all my wishes come true, coming true and see Omkara Taro, this is all in reverse, right? All my cups are drained. I'm free. I want to be free. I want to have a brand new beginning. Um, I'm just enjoying my baby freedom at the moment. So, Hierophant, Hierophant, yes, this Queen of Swords could be 
not wanting to put in any more effort into this commitment with this king of wands at the moment they're tired i think they just want to drop the baggage they don't they feel i've been carrying the entire weight of this connection i've been juggling i've been tired i just want to drop all this um maybe who's taking away then spirit seven of swords what's the seven of swords seven of swords as much as i think this is the queen of swords who's trying to escape this connection or commitment this this uh, king of wands is going to come back as an emperor they want to offer a, a new beginning a passionate new beginning do something to heal this broken heart of this uh, queen of swords right the devil what's the devil Yeah, they've been feeling left out in the cold. They've, they've been feeling judged. They want to open up now. They feel all the mind games that I played on this uh, Queen of Swords. Now they're feeling like I lost out, and my my Empress has walked away. So there's a bit of fear, I think, as well. Anger, fear, whatever. I don't know. There's some somebody is very scared that all their control tactics or whatever have pushed this Empress away from them. so they're feeling judged and they are worried that they may not get a second chance with this empress now so what's the death card spirit what's the death card oh okay no the too many cards of commitment in this reading i have the 10 of cups 10 of pentacles i have the hierophant twice well whoever this person is who's making a move now whoever's coming this king of wands and whatever Uh, they're coming back as an emperor to say, "Hey, I'm, I'm not going to keep any more secrets from you. I want to reveal all, whatever my toxic ways are. I'm ready to give those up. Right? Let's remove the toxicity from this connection. Let's put an end to whatever bad that happened in the past. Will you accept my cup of love? They're coming in with a big cup of love." offering i think a brand new beginning spirit what's the full card as our overall energy for uh, taurus now the full card yes the coming in with an apology and a love offer of hey can we begin again this king of wands is coming back as an emperor to say hey i know i was wrong i did wrong they're feeling they're very scared they feel they they basically sabotage this connection or anyway they're coming back with a cup of love offering whether the queen of uh, swords accepts it or not that's totally up to them but this is what this other person is that's in their mind okay they want to come back and rectify things they want to say hey can we just have a brand new beginning Let's end all this whatever bad behavior, bad fights, whatever happened, any anything that was toxic. Let's get rid of that, put an end to that, and let's start afresh. So that's all I have for you, Taurus. Till next time, then. Love and light. Take care. Namaste.